what's going on everybody welcome back to the channel as always like subscribe comment and help us grow uh today i was just going to take y'all on a little ride and more or less just uh we'll get down here to a better setting and talk about the first impressions on this motos tractionator adventure tire that i'm running now um first we get dusted out by the jeep mother i already tell you It propels forward when you give it gas like that, I can tell you that much. A lot better than that Shinko did. Well, there it is. Like I said, this is the Motaz Tractionator Adventure. It's a 150 70 17 is the size on that um, Like I said, it's got about 75 maybe 100 miles on it. So not even really broke in yet I know but uh, just giving you a first kind of my first thoughts on it first impression um, On road it's good. It's got a little bit of a roar noise to it, but nothing crazy loud uh, The transition like when you're going in turns from right to left leaning the bike over uh, it falls over fine. It don't have any kind of notchy feeling like a big knobby wood. It's got a good smooth transition to it um, And does pretty good on road as far as I hadn't had it in a lot of mountain curvy roads yet But like I said, I've leaned it pretty hard just playing with it and Seems to be good on that aspect as um, far as off-road I could tell when you when you hit the throttle. It's got a good forward bite I mean the bike launches where that Shinko would slip a little bit then launch it, it this bites immediately and launches the bike and the best thing about it, it ain't got that step out feeling like every time you hit the throttle the rear end wants to kick out on you that shinko did that really bad and this tire uh seems to hold its line a lot lot straighter now you still got a little bit because of the way of the bike and stuff but the tire holds its line way way better um one other thing i do want to mention uh if you're going down the road uh, they will catch like rain grooves or grooves in the street they will catch it and they do wiggle a little bit so if you're timid about that kind of thing this might not be the tire for you but like i said we'll give you a better look as it goes on longevity wise and once it gets a couple thousand miles on i'll do an update on it and see how it's holding up but like i said you can see i mean it looks good on the bike too i mean it makes the bike look pretty beefy so i'll give you some good shot of the tread right there it's a good beefy looking tire i'm impressed with it so far i think i'm gonna be happy with it so hopefully it'll get at least uh, 6,000 miles. Most people are saying they're getting anywhere from six to eight. So we'll see. Uh, it's getting into summertime now, so we'll see how it holds up when the roads get hot. But I think it's gonna be a good one. Like I said, it's the Motos Tractionator Adventure. Well, there it is. I just wanted to give you my first thoughts, initial thoughts on the Motos Tractionator Adventure. So far, really liking it. I know I have much time on it, but that's why it's the first impression of it. Um, I think it's gonna be a good tire definitely a lot better off-road just see how long it lasts longevity wise Going on longer trips and once we get up into the mileage and the summer times come with the heat and see how it holds up But so far really liking it. And I think it's gonna be a good one So uh, we'll definitely give you an update later on that and how it's holding up long term But thanks for watching and like I said before like subscribe comment help us grow and we'll see y'all in the next one